So um, 10 guidelines for healthy lifestyle, and I'll start with one, maintaining a healthy weight. So as you get older, that's a little harder, um, but it's important again. So if you start early with a nice exercise regime, it can help you with that and some nutrition. If you can stay away from saturated fat, there's some things in there that trigger the cells that help um, uh, feed cancer cells. Maintaining a, a, a nice regime of healthy exercise and increasing it when you can. Limit your, your drink, your alcoholic uh, beverages. It's in, um, it is an increase. It has been known to show that it helps you know, the cells grow within, with breast cancer. Some of us will look at some hormone replacement therapy. And again, that's another cautionary um, you know, avenue to look at is what those levels are because as you change your hormones uh, in your body, it can change you know, how your body reacts to or develops cancer cells. Fleet has uh, mentioned over and over again, know, your, know yourself, know your medical condition, know your health condition, know your family history. Um, those are things that you have to know and make aware to your physician. So getting your regular checkups, doing your PHA, when we say birth month free call and we say get your dental checkup and your medical health, it's not because we have a check in the blocks, you know, to make and say what was done, but it's to keep you healthy, not just for yourself, but for combat as well. So make sure you get to those appointments. Stay away from tobacco. So uh, you, know, you know the risk of the tobacco. It's on the, it's on the label, so stay away. We can help at the Naval Hospital. You can also get help at the hospital or Fleet Family Support Center or um, in other uh, classes uh, with uh, the gym and so forth on stress management. Very important because as your stress increases, it does all kinds of chemical things in your body, and it can lower uh, some of your defenses. So keeping up your stress uh, you know, mechanisms in the proper stress and combating it is very important. Rest, learn how to relax. That'll help also. Early detection, folks. Early, early detection. Make sure that uh, you get in there and uh, you'll survive it. The stronger and the healthier you are, the, 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 the more the, uh, your chances of uh, being healthy through the procedure and healthy after through the, the process. Don't wait for things to happen to you. Make them happen for you.